สวัสดีครับผู้ฟังทุกท่านยินดีต้อนรับเข้าสู่รายการของผมรูดีครับ Hello and welcome to Thai Letters. This course or this lesson deals with the letter B by my. First, we'll have a look at how to write the consonant. Then we will have a look or practice pronunciation together. After that, we will see examples of words and letters of how, of when the letter Baba Ma is used and how it can be represented within different fonts. At the end, you will be given chance to uh, practice by doing a couple of exercises related to the Baba Ma consonant. If you haven't taken a look at course introduction video, I highly recommend to do that now because information will be given on how the lesson is structured and what the different references, like for instance, coloration in the background of the consonants mean. Writing of Bavamai. Bavamai is a letter which is represented by the letter itself, the consonant itself. So ba. And a marker word which is by my, and the tones which belong to this letter are a middle tone for the consonant, and a middle and high tone for the marker word. You can see that the marker word by my is a two syllable word, therefore, it needs two tones one for the first syllable and one for the second syllable. So the consonant itself has a middle tone, ba, and the marker word has two syllables, middle tone and high tone, by my, by my, by my, which means leaf of a plant, of a tree, whatever. Let's see how the consonant is written by hand. Ba by my, ba by my, ba by my. Try to practice this on an extra sheet of paper on your own, or by downloading the exercise sheets which are provided on thailanguageprogram.com. Pronunciation. Let's practice a little bit together how to pronounce the letter. I will read it out loud, and you follow right after. Whenever the writing turns red, it is your turn. Let's try the first three examples or first three lines. Ba by my, and you. Okay, one more time. Ba by my. Great. Again. Ba by my. Excellent. And the three remaining ones. Ba by my. Great. Ba oh sorry. Ba by my. Ba by my. Since we're in the flow. Uh, for practice and purpose, let's do another round. Ba by my. 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 Sorry for the confusion with the coloring. Uh, my finger probably is too fast today. Too much coffee or whatnot. Anyway, try to as often as you can repeat this practice on your own. And also, it's very helpful when you're trying to memorize the consonants by just repeating it for yourself and maybe while writing, repeating it also by speaking it out loud. Alright, let's see a couple of examples of fonts of 
on how the uh, Barbie Mai can be represented with different font types as always for you in order to see the differences or the variety of displacement and representations of this very consonant within Thai writing. Of course there are many many other fonts that are not displayed here, it's just a couple of examples of what you can encounter in everyday life when for instance exactly uh, especially while when you take a look at newspapers and magazines stuff like that. In books usually they use a font which is very easy, easy to be read like the one I have at the top left corner in the heading of each slide. Within this excerpt of text from a newspaper let's now try to see if we can find the Baba Mai that is to be found in here. There is one in the very first line within the red circle as you can see and there is of course another one in the second line. Another example where do we find the Baba Mai here? There is one in the very first line at the beginning and I guess that's it. Then we have another example and we try to find the Bob I Mai. I give you a couple of seconds to scan the text and see if you can already find on your own where the Bob I Mai is placed. If so, I can then represent it by indicating it, drawing a circle right at the beginning of the first line. Another example here, try to find the Bob I Mai within these three lines of text and see how many you can find and where you position them. Actually in the first line I can't see any, also in the second, but in the third line at the very beginning there is a ball by my, ball by my, sorry, at the very beginning. Alright, with these examples and inspirations in mind let's now do a little exercise for you. I display as always a text fragment that you should be familiar with by now and also uh, and another additional of text fragments and excerpts from newspapers and whatnot and you can now try to circle it maybe you still have it printed out you can try to circle the Baba Mai within these text fragments and try to find them Make sure that before you go on playing this video, you pause it right here and solve the exercise. And then once you're done finding and marking the bar by my or memorizing where the position is, before you now compare it with the results or solutions, you, you should make sure that you're finished. Okay, warning, hereby again, the solutions are about to be displayed Please make sure you have finished all the exercises before you continue. Again the text fragments and I will now indicate the positions of the different Baba Mai's. Within the first text, in the first line we have an example of Baba Mai. In the third line we have two right after each other and one in the very middle and a couple of words after that another one. And uh, in the fourth and last line of the first part we have a ball and my close to the beginning and then again before the middle or in front of the middle and in the very middle and one towards the end okay in the pink backgrounded excerpt we have one in the first line and in the black example after that also in the first line we have two actually three examples of ball and my and uh, we have in the second line another one before the middle and in the third and very last example of excerpt again we have a couple of examples within that uh, writing where we can find ball and mice yeah by now you should be familiar with how to not only write the consonant but also how to detect it within text and how the different font types and styles work. 
If you want to do ex additional exercises so far on writing, please feel free to access the additional exercise material on thailanguageprogram.com. You have, of course, to sign up for the free membership or free forum access membership that you can access on by clicking on forum and then you're granted to access all the exercise material that are uh, publicly available within the within the the um, the um, uh, sub <laughs> uh, sub page of this particular course, Thai letters. Two exercises look sheets like like this. So you basically in the first one have to fill in fill in, fill in the bottom eyes by writing it and try to speak it out loud while writing. And in the second sheet, you basically present the missing letter by writing bottom and my wherever you find these points underneath the text lines. The next very useful lesson on Thai letters will be ba 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 and you can access this lesson by clicking on the button provided on this very screen. Hereby I would like to thank you for your attention, I would like to thank you for your appreciation and whatnot and I hope to see you again in next lesson. Bye bye. Chokti Sawati